Welcome to 321 Photoshop, I'm Julianne Cost. Here are seven tips to help you get the most out of the history panel in Photoshop. To set the number of history states that Photoshop keeps track of, select Preferences and then Performance. Setting a higher number will save more changes, allowing you to step further back in time. However, it will also require Photoshop to keep track of more information in RAM, or when all of the RAM is in use, to the scratch disk. By default, if you go back in time and then execute another command, you lose the history states from that point forwards. To retain the states, select History Options and enable Nonlinear History. Now, even after making additional changes, you can still return to any of the previous states in history. If you often toggle the visibility of layers but don't want them to count as a step in history, disable Make Layer Visibility Changes Undoable. Because Photoshop automatically creates a snapshot when opening a file, you can undo an accidental save by clicking on the snapshot in the history panel, saving the file, and then returning to your current state and choosing Save As. Selecting Clear History from the flyout will clear the history to free up RAM or scratch disk space. However, you can still choose Edit Undo Clear History. Holding Option on the Mac or Alt on Windows and selecting Clear History will delete the history without the option to undo, as if you've closed the file and reopened it. In order to keep a record of commands applied to a file in Photoshop, select Preferences and then History Log. You can choose to save the logged items to the metadata inside the file, to an external file, or to both, as well as select a level of detail to record. Sessions will only record a minimal amount of information, such as when files are open, saved, and closed. Concise will record the name of the command, such as levels or curves, and Detail will record the name of the command as well as the settings applied. Finally, to quickly duplicate a document, click the Create New Document from Current State icon at the bottom of the History panel.